So you're thinking about buying a home? There are many things to consider when buying a home. I'm going to tell you the things you should never say when looking at homes. Coming right up. Okay, so when you go out to view property with your realtor, in some cases you will find the seller is present or the listing agent is present. If this situation arises, there are a few things that you need to keep in mind. So if the homeowner is present, it's best not to make negative comments while you're viewing the home. Things like paint color, carpeting, window treatments, these things can all be changed. The home may actually work for your needs, even though it's ugly as hell. You, however, may want to make an offer, and it's best not to make the seller have hard feelings because you dogged this house the entire time that you were there. You want the seller to like you. It'll work out much better when it comes time to negotiate and getting a little bit shaved off of that asking price. Second thing to keep in mind when viewing homes is not to make positive remarks while you're there either. Don't say things like, I love this home. This home is perfect. And do not say, this is my dream home. Really? My dream home? Both the seller and the listing agent are now salivating. You have now made it much harder for them to come down on price. They know you love it, they know you want it, and they know you're willing to pay more for it. Keep those comments to yourself. Another thing you need to keep on the lowdown is your personal situation. Don't say things like, I'm in a rush. I need to close in 30 days. Don't say that. Another thing you shouldn't do is letting the seller or listing agent know about your failed offers on other homes. Don't tell them that you just missed out on the best home and you're desperate. It's best to keep this information private they will certainly keep that in mind when it comes time to negotiating. I know I would. You ever heard of having a poker face? Get one. Here's another one. Don't ask the seller or the listing agent what's included. You've just now successfully added a bargaining chip for their side. Let your buyer's agent write it into the deal. All they can do is say no or yes. Never negotiate with the seller while you're there. You're going to put him in a very uncomfortable situation. It is the listing agent's job to negotiate on the seller's behalf. Take it up with your buyer's agent and they will take it up with the listing agent. One other thing you need to keep in mind when going out to see homes. We live in a digital age. Even though the seller may not be there, many sellers often have networked cameras with microphones. So even though they're not there, they certainly could be listening. Be very aware of your surroundings because Big Brother is often watching. I quite often coach my buyers before we walk into any showing to keep it zip. Words on the no list. I love, it's perfect. Can't wait to move in. If you're interested in local neighborhoods, buying or selling real estate tips, or just points of interest here in the Treasure Coast, maybe think about subscribing. I try to put out a video at least once every other week and maybe you'll find something that's helpful to you. I'm Lisa Ammons. Thank you for stopping by.
A thumbs up is always appreciated. Website links are below if you care to search for homes or contact me directly.